Welcome to Bosch Connected World here from Berlin. And I'm here with Marcus Spies, your research scientist at the Bosch Lab for AI. And we see some adaptive learning from the machine, this robot behind us. Can you explain what the challenge is for robots to detect objects and how you solve these types in your research, um, in your research lab? So one of the challenges that we are facing is um, for the robot to know where objects are in the environment. And what we are using here is um, deep learning technologies. That's a modern way of figuring out from an image where an object is. And we teach the robot by showing it examples of how the object looks like. Um, and then it is able to generalize and is able to afterwards, also in new scenarios, figure out where the object is to then um, grasp it and assemble it, um, in our case, for the Bosch e-bike motor. And can you explain how you do this learning? Is it a database with images, or is it learning by practice? Um, there are different approaches. Uh, one approach is um, the classical way, I would say, is taking images and labeling it. But that's, of course, um, a lot of work for someone to label all the images. So another approach that we are currently looking into is um, to generate data automatically. Um, when we have the um, cut models of the objects, which we mostly have in industrial settings, we can render photorealistic images that are automatically labeled and then use those for learning. And if you look now in practice, what's different from how it's operating now? So mostly in industrial settings, um, you have to palletize objects that are exactly um, at the position where you expect them. Um, we, are, we want to go into a scenario where objects can be scattered around and the robot figures out where the objects are, take them and put them into place. All right. Marcus, thanks a lot for sharing all your research projects and thank you for watching here from Bosch Connect World in Berlin. Enjoy this video? Don't forget to like, subscribe, share and get notifications of my new video.